Hello, my YouTubians. Danny here from Chasing Bulls Inspectors, and welcome to my new series, Danny Approved Paranormal Channels. Or Seabass Approved Paranormal Channels. Uh, these are channels that uh, I believe in, that uh, I believe the, the investigators or the people in the, in the groups are real and uh, collect awesome good evidence. Uh, so please enjoy this series, leave comments, check out the people that are in the series because uh, they're approved by me and I think they're awesome. All right, talk to you later. What I like here is he keeps his team informed exactly what he's feeling. I'm already doing the full breeze right here. What was this room used for? What did you used to do in this room? It's around me. What are you doing right now? Marking disembodied voices is a must if you investigate. I just heard like a yell or like a howling type sound. Yeah, and it's, it's... Other than that, there's no howling. Maybe a howling or no. Better to double check your area just in case, like this. I'm moving around. I'm investigating, making sure there's no douchebags hiding in here. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Around. Let me just look right in here real quick. Make sure there's no assholes hiding. It is good to mark orbs in case they become relevant to your investigation at a later date. We're catching orbs and we're just setting up. Before I press record, we saw two or three big bright ones. Setting yourself up uh, for your investigation helps to eliminate false positive information. We're sitting between two bedrooms. The camera is set up in between two bedrooms. Being respectful to the spirits builds trust as seen here. Remember, with spirits, a little kindness goes a long way. You can come talk to my light. We're not going to hurt you. You don't have to be scared of us. We don't mean any disrespect. We just want to talk to you guys. Maybe learn a little bit about you and who you were. Note all of your personal experiences for later. Something with my own eyes moving across the room. That way. Where? This way. What I love about these two is they take good information on board. You want to push me down the stairs? I'm a big guy. Come on, try and push me.
I explained how this could be taken as a threat and that they might go ahead and do it and they should not. To their credit, they never did it again, and I'm so very proud of them for doing that. Good job, you two. Can you give a yes or no? Should we leave this place? Some awesome interaction right here. Hi, what's your name? You can talk to me. This is the benchmark of tagging evidence. Great job, you two. Proud of you. Wait, what am I doing? Sorry. Did you work for Mr. Adams? Instantly in the center of the ring, weaving around and went towards like the right, to your left. Was he a good employer to be walking around? Did he treat you fair? Again. Again. We don't mean any disrespect. We're just here to talk to you guys. To learn about you. You walking around. We have recorders with little red lights. You can talk in any of them if you have a message. Can you tell me what your name is? Babe, it's right around you. It's right in front of you. When I just came back towards me. Oh, I got the heat. Oh my God, it's right in front of me. I have chills all over my arms. I like something's touching me. Look at my arms. I know the camera can't see it, but I can see it from here. Sorry, this is... central in here, man. Oh, yeah. there it is again. I just need a minute. Sorry. That's me moving. I just heard something with my own ears. It was me. It was this thing moving. And that is how it is done. What can I say? Sometimes spirits are just a bunch of dicks. Hmm. <laughs>
you have any message for anybody that you would like to send? I really appreciate you talking to us. Wait, this was not in the brochure, damn it all. What the hell? There it is, a bat. <laughs> it's a bat. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, he's still in there. <laughs> and fucking just something that you looked fine like. And then it wasn't until after I got that feeling that I realized that exactly where we were. I'm like short of breath. I have the goosebumps. I feel completely creeped out right now. So, we caught you on video last time. We saw you. Saw you moving your arms up and down. What exactly were you doing? That was my mouth. The hell was that? What the fuck was that? That wasn't the camera? No. I heard that. to the hospital. Obviously, I don't know if that's dust or if that shit's shooting around. It is pitch fucking black. Can't see anything. Is it okay that we're in here? Okay. Crave back is about to jump. Come on. We're coming down. Let us know as we're walking by if we should come to this, come to your room. Who wants to say hi? I'm fucking creep the fuck out. This is another relative uh, little session. There we go. Tell me what cell block are we in? Do you know?
You didn't have anyone? I'm sorry you didn't have anyone. How old are you? <laughs> Where? Damn, we're getting full fucking sentences on this fucking thing. Stand in chains. Is this a cell? I can't see anything. Did they chain you to the cell? Give you for dinner. Talk about a relevant EVP capture. Class A. Yeah, I can't see you at all. I can't see you either. <laughs> Just so you guys know, we are in complete darkness right now. We can't see anything. I know the cross is over there somewhere, and you can't see back here. I can't even see you at all. I can't see I can you hear either. you, but I, I can't, can't see, see your you. red light. <laughs> it's very dark in here. Was that you? No, I, uh, I was making sure the lights were on. Okay. You are hearing the fact that it is raining outside? Courtesy does pay off. Check this out and you'll see. Are you right around us? Thank you. When you feel the need to regroup, do it. Trust your instincts. It can help. I am feeling I need to move. I need to adjust myself. There is no, right when you said that, there was a light right next to you. I felt it. I felt it on my arms, and I felt I just needed it. What's right here? I know there's That's a chair. I have to move. I didn't like that. Well, there you have it, my YouTubians, episode two of season one of Sea Bass Approved Channels. Uh, the Paranormal Veil, uh, which we have just watched. Uh, I hope you thoroughly enjoyed it. They are an awesome, awesome team. Uh, uh, they have respect for the spirits, respect for, for everyone watching. And, uh, of course, their integrity is bar none. Um, really love these two. Uh, fantastic, fantastic young uh, channel, young people, and I, and I, I, I pretty much, you know, they're going to go far, and uh, they're going to be around for a while, so you'll be wanting to follow them, keep an eye on them, uh, because like I say, I love them the bits, and they're a fantastic uh, group, and, and they're very thorough, and very um, positive with their, ev uh, with their evidence, and uh, they're very real people, and uh, yeah, you, you need to watch these ones, okay? Uh, now, also, there's many, many uh, others that are going to come. Episode 3 will come whenever it comes. Uh, i got a lot of cinemas to watch through. 
uh, for the next person that or persons that are that are being uh, on my next episode. And you never know; it could be you. All right. So make sure you leave a comment, you know, and uh, check these people out. All right, because uh, like I say, they're fantastic, and and I'm very proud of them uh, for all that they've done so far. And I know I'll continue to be proud of them in the future. All right. So please make sure you, you zip over there, check them out. Let them know that uh, you saw them on the show. And uh, love and blessings. All right. So now remember, everybody, take care of yourselves. Take care of your family. Watch out for ghosts. <laughs> and have a great day. Bye. Speaking of ghosts, won't shut off. <laughs>